Hello all, this video is going to show you how to view some information about student test scores. As you can see, we are logged in with a training account, so this does not reflect actual student data. Okay, so to view student test information, we're going to go up here on the left to the menu and choose the last icon in the series, which is an arrow. The top choice in that is test group analysis. So we'll go ahead and choose that. It takes just a second to load. And here we will be able to see our test results for our students. So down here under test preferences, I can see what tests are available for me to gain data on. So I can look at data on the DRA, SOLs, the VAF, VGLA, and WIDA if they're applicable. So let's stick here with SOL grade 3. Test group part allows you to narrow the results that you see. So right now we've got math selected. If I choose this white space up here, then that will display all of their test scores that it would be possible for them to take in third grade in the SOL. So let's change that back to math. Test display type. I can choose from this menu what I want to see um, in regards to tests that they may have taken multiple times. So I can see the most recent score, highest score, and an assortment of other things. This isn't particularly helpful necessarily for the SOL test, but it might be helpful for some of the other tests that they've taken. So we'll just leave that blank. Only show students with results will remove any student who has not taken that test. So for instance, I can see Alfredo has not taken this test. If I choose this box, then he's no longer in the displayed results. Highlight performance levels will highlight their scores. So for instance, if I choose that I want to highlight the students who failed this test, these two students down here are highlighted in very, very faint orange because they have failing scores. And down here, score type filter uh, will allow me to choose whether or not I want these last two columns to show. So for instance, number correct, if I select that box, then only the number correct will show. The SOL scale score will not. If I deselect this, then the SOL scale score comes back. Same thing for if I check this box, then the number correct will go away. And if I want to print this information, I'm able to do that from this icon right here. I just have to click one time on it and it will do the work for me in generating a PDF document. So I'm clicking on it and it's thinking. And then there is my test data available for me to print if I wish. That's about it for test data that you can view in ISIS. If you have any questions, please see your aspects. Thank you.